anyone can breed a puppy, but it takes years of experience, education, and a lot of hard work to properly raise a puppy and set it up for success. The first 12 weeks of a puppy's life are critical and shape your puppy's future. Be sure you select a breeder that knows how to take advantage of every single opportunity and is willing to do the work it takes to raise a puppy to its fullest potential. When you get a puppy from us, you receive a puppy that comes from known, health-tested, temperament-tested lines. You experience a puppy that has been properly imprinted, socialized with humans, dogs, cats, and other animals. Your puppy will have had the advantage of having started crate training and basic puppy training. All of our breeding dogs are tested for genetic diseases, the results of which we make available online. They are examined by a qualified veterinarian to ensure there are no problems that can't be detected through DNA testing, such as hip and elbow dysplasia, cardiac problems, and so forth. These tests are also available to interested puppy parents on request. Our puppies are bred, born, and raised in our home. They have the security and comfort of a home environment from day one, and they are exposed immediately to the sounds, sights, and smells of a comfortable dwelling. Puppies undergo traditional imprinting as well as the Early Neurological Stimulation Imprinting Program, which was developed by the U.S. military to help enhance the natural abilities of newborn pups. Our Enhanced Enrichment Program is scientifically designed to take advantage of each stage of puppy development. This program includes lots of specifically timed exposure to unusual stimuli, such as loud noises. Exposing a puppy to the right amount, but not too much, of a potentially scary thing helps strengthen their nervous systems and teaches them to face and overcome new challenges. This produces a puppy that is more eager to investigate new sounds, sights, and smells rather than to be afraid of them. As you can see here, our puppies are so interested in new, unusual things that they think the vacuum is fun and exciting, not scary like many other dogs do. Our puppies are also trained in a way that teaches them to be eager to learn and to know how to learn and interact appropriately with people. One of the biggest complaints dog owners have is that their dog jumps on people. If you watch dogs interact with each other, they jump on each other to get attention and to instigate play. That is what they are hardwired to do. More often than not, a puppy jumps on a person for attention and gets the attention it wants. This serves to reinforce the behavior every single time it happens, so that by the time the dog is six months old or a year or older, it has learned daily to jump on people for what it wants. These puppy parents have unwittingly taught their puppy to behave badly and set them up for potential failure to integrate them well into the family as it gets larger and more demanding. We break that cycle very early in the puppy's development so that puppies and puppy parents are on the road to success from the very start. We start as early as possible to teach our puppies in a different way to ask for attention, one that is compatible with living in harmony with a human family. We teach our dogs that they only get attention when they are not jumping on or pawing at people, that they get attention particularly when they sit and when they focus on their humans. This is known in behavioral science as manding, not only does this teach a puppy the early stages of being polite, but it actually gives them a voice and a way of interacting with humans to politely ask for something such as attention or food. Another problem encountered by new puppy parents is separation anxiety. When puppies go home with their puppy parents for the first time, they are separated from the only home they have known, their litter mates, their mother, and the people who raised them. As you can imagine, this creates a great deal of anxiety. Then the puppies are isolated further by being put in a crate or locked alone in a kitchen or mudroom at night when it feels most vulnerable. This is terrifying to a young pup. So we start teaching our puppies to be comfortable in crates as early as possible. We gradually teach them that it's safe and okay to be alone in a crate through the use of positive reinforcement and gentle habituation. Your puppy may still cry a little when it comes home for the first time, but it will be much less panicked than a pup that has no exposure to a crate and to being separated from its family, and it will recover faster from the stress and become comfortable much quicker. We start the potty training process as soon as the puppies are weaned. Dogs are naturally clean animals and they quickly learn that there's a place specifically for elimination. We send you home with our easy and effective program to transition housebreaking into your home, but it is important to remember that when puppies go home at nine or 10 weeks of age, they are only capable of holding it in for a few hours at a time.
We send our puppies home with a basket of goodies, including food, supplements, treats, toys, a crate, a training guide, grooming products, microchip and health information, and your first month's pet health insurance. We will teach you how to continue all of the training we have started and are available for lifetime breeder support. If you have a problem, email or call us and we will do whatever we can to help you. Thank you for considering a cosmopolitan puppy.